sensitivity has different types. There's tactile or touch, which is a normal feeling, and there's obviously the erotic and erogenous sensation associated with that part of the, of the body. Um, even though there is a potential that surgery may impair all of those types of um, sensation, I have never had a patient that's experienced a loss of that sensitivity. The reason for that is that the nerves that are important tend to come from above um, through the clitoris and therefore a standard labiaplasty should not address and will preserve those nerves. So the only area where the, the, the tissue is going to lose sensitivity is generally the tissue that's been discarded uh, and once the um, patients recover from the swelling and the after effects of the anaesthetic of the surgery, there should, I have never had a patient that's experienced loss of sensitivity in the area. Obviously I'd like to add, even though we talked about touch, which is present uh, normal tactile sensation everywhere. Obviously, um, in the female genitalia, um, the erotic and erogenous sensation is important, particularly in the clitoris, for the ability to climax and reach orgasm. Uh, and as I've said before, I, I make sure that the nerves that are important for that are not affected. And therefore, this very, very important function of the sensitivity of the nerves down there should not be impaired. And there should be no reason why patients shouldn't be able to achieve uh, climax as a, as a result of having the surgery.